Hello and welcome to Hearts of Iron 4 Kaiserreich. We are back and I'm playing as Poland and I'm playing as Sweden. Yeah, and uh, look at my country leader. It's literally a crown on a pillow. That's Mine my is, uh, that's my country leader. Uh, Gustav the fifth Bernadotte. Yeah, Sounds you have it. No, you have a king. Um, yeah, big mustache. I don't mustache. have a king. I have a council who needs to elect a king, but they are a bit lazy and stupid. So I need to do a, a national focus um, to elect a king. And uh, basically what I will try to do is restore the Polish-Lithuanian Commonwealth. And you will try and grab Norway, Denmark and Finland. So, and we have, will form kind of a Baltic alliance, if that's possible. Um, my manpower is kind of okay. What is okay? 162k. Oh, I've already got more of that. Yeah. Only, well, it's not as much as you would expect. So, I'm gonna train just three divisions. Uh, let's make some convoys. We'll need those for trade. The US, yay, we're trading with the US. Some oil, uh, please, uh, thank you. So, r right now, I'm not in any faction, but I'm... I probably will join your faction if you make one. So, oh my God. You, you have um, this focus tree, and on the right, you have Scandinavian uh, I'm diplomacy. On that. I'm ready to so do you that. need to do uh, revanchism, but you can only do that after 1939. So then you can grab all the countries. In the meantime, you can you can go to form a new government, and we will need to go down the uh, support enterprise, mm -hmm. and then the and then the the greater good. And then eventually reinstate the monarchy. That's something I think you will want to have the monarchy back. You see that? Yeah. Uh, I see protectionism. And then if you look at my focus tree, I'm now doing the great debate. Uh, so it's the great debate. Who who will be our king? Will we even have a king? And then I can I will probably go down the uh, Lithuanian king. Minority rights, okay. the Vilnius Accord, and then I can form the Polish-Lithuanian uh, Commonwealth, and then I will have a whole new focus tree. So let's begin now. Get these oh, messages yeah. again. Only yeah. inform me about major events. Well, now I want to know everything about the Polish Polish elections, but you don't want to know that, <laughs> I guess. Uh, I start off with twelve divisions. I start off with uh, 13 divisions or 14. Okay, the situation in Poland, so I'm gonna let you read this, uh, the viewers. Um, it's not looking good for us. We are this very small kingdom. Well, we're not even a kingdom because we have no king. And how barbaric. We will want to take all back this land. We have no claims on this right now, but historically speaking, oh we do have claims on this land though, on on this piece. I don't know, yeah. Uh, Prussia, you can be Prussia. Oh, nice I guess. The great debate continues. Okay, unfortunate. How's your uh, thing going? Uh, pretty okay, I think. Someone was murdered. Yeah, the Russian president. Yeah. And Edward the Seventh is now the King of Britain. Ha have you accepted my uh, non-aggression pact? Oh, I haven't seen it yet. Okay, there it is. So now, uh, I have the non-aggression pact with a crown. Well, yeah, with a <laughs> crown on a pillow. <laughs> Royal um, household. Oh boy, this is old. Basically, um. Yeah, you will have to um, strengthen your monarchy. So yeah. everything you do will need to strengthen your monarchy. In uh, historical focus, 
Kaiserreich. I've always seen Canada go the democratic way. I've never seen them abolishing the parliament. So in that way we were um, a bit not historical in that sense. Look, there's a giant cannon next to my capital. Black Monday! Black Monday. Uh, this is something different. Uh, well, you were hit last time as the USA. Yeah. But now I am hit too, as well. And you are hit as well, I, I think. We're all hit. Yeah, we're all hit because you are uh, you have Swedish Black Monday and I have effects of Black Monday. Construction speed minus 50%. You have a bit more different stuff. You have a lot of... Um, oh. Minus 20%. It's all minus 20. Okay, um, I will need to send some uh, police to uh, the farms or the uh, countryside because I want to keep my monarchy in place. I have the, the great debate this is still going on they're debating who who will be our king uh, yeah I could do this but I wanna go for a confrontation with Austria eventually so I hope Austria does does a really bad this game because I Need want to okay let's land. train some for the learning made a Artillery. Where those are. Oh my god. I'm not making any equipment right now because of the Black Monday stuff. So uh I don't know where I can't do anything except for um making Ah. If I want to uh delete the black monday stuff i need to reintroduce the zloty so that's oh warsaw has been bombed apparently by z by an anarchist anarchist party okay so my political power is already minus 57 <laughs> okay so i have one of these messages that's really telling you about the effectiveness of my government I'm gonna read it to you because it's really funny uh, I'm gonna pause it though the most recent debate to enthrall the members of the Regency Council has to do with whether or not the future King of Poland needs to be at least as tall as the last King of Poland so as to be more imposing in stature stature true progress seems as far off as ever and then I have two options height is meaningless height is everything <laughs> So they are debating um, the height of our future king. <laughs> I'm gonna tell them that height doesn't matter at all because Napoleon was a short guy and he almost took all of Europe. Oh no, Romania. Romania. Romania is one of the few countries uh, in the world that does the same as in real life. <laughs> They uh, are fascist uh, or national populists. I'm curious what's going to happen in North America right now. Yeah, um... Because we... That's, uh, well, we'll see how it turns yeah, out. Yeah, but in my game as South Africa single player mm -hmm. uh, that I played, uh, the United States won. They won? Yes, oh. they won. But Canada took um, Alaska, though, and, uh, and the Panama Canal. And England, New England was independent. That's something I didn't do okay. because I could use the uh, military factories if I annexed it and then gave it back to you. But yeah. So. Then you got the whole of your cash back. Yeah, well. Um, so you need to be careful because you are really. Um, you can be. Uh, I think your country is very susceptible for uh, syndicalists. If you look at your uh, government, they have the radical socialists are have a popularity of seven percent. The syndicalists of four. Oh, okay. So uh, it's, you, now you are social conservative. But uh, what are you doing now? The, the Saab. It's what? Ah, uh, oh, down there. Yeah. Uh, yeah, down there. Um. Because I can't 
to form a new government until September. Oh yeah. yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah, I so forgot that. To do something else in the meantime. Yeah. Let's see. Uh, <sighs> so I'm gonna put my troops on this border because uh, well we're gonna want to take that eventually <laughs> the great debate puzzle mostly so that's also something very uh, oh my god Um, as the Union of Britain, some one of your guys is. So you have also Mosley. He was in real life. He was a fascist, but you can all also have a guy called Blair. I don't know his, his first name, Blair, but uh, he's basically George Orwell, ah. the writer of 1984. And it's funny because he's part of the Totalists. And the totalist was something he described kind of in his book. This totalist regime. Okay. So. Oh, oh yeah, that war. Still, the Dominion of India is still fighting uh, against Afghanistan. Afghanistan. They have taken Keta already. So uh, that's good for them, I guess. I've never seen them actually annex the whole country. They've always puppeted them or white pieced them. I hope we see some puppets because annexing is a uh, it makes them stronger. We don't want that. Yeah, my uh, population is actually growing fast. I think. The Kawiki. <laughs> I'm gonna have all these difficult to pronounce names. Like what's well. this? Partia Monarchistesnia. I'll do my best if and there you have are any Swedish viewers, but probably <laughs> screw it up. You have the Hergern Zriksorganisation. Okay, basic machine tools and the Arab Congress. Okay, oh, they've already. signed a white piece. So probably not a puppet, but took back some states. Yeah. And now they turned an um, fascist. They they are now the Islamic State of Afghanistan. Oh, okay. Where have we seen that before? Mm, I, I, I really don't know. <laughs> General, uh, oh my god, my political power is now minus 194. Oh no, the Pope died The Pope died. And we are very Catholic here in um, Poland. Ooh. Oh, we have that war. That war is popped up again. So, um... In my playthrough as South Africa, Germany didn't get involved and uh, they basically just annexed the African colonies of Portugal wow, nice. and it was a white piece so I kind of thought that was nice instead of just Germany annexing Portugal and then puppeting them. But yeah, I want to take, how is this called? Galicia Lodomeria. Uh, I think the first thing I'm going to take. Uh, but yeah, my political power is really in a shithole. Um, great debate. Uh, the great debate is almost done. Uh, oh, okay. The Regency Council must elect a king now. So, we're not gonna let the military take over or syndicalists take over. No, this crown. Oh, there's apparently a cobweb on it. This crown with some dust and cobweb on it, on a pillow, must choose a king. Oh, downfall and stability. So I have now low stability. Italian monarchy restored. Wow. Mm. That's good, I guess. Um, I, 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 I okay, anarcho um, thing about Jay? Yeah, yeah, I got an extra low military stability. factory. Hooray. You managed to build one? Yep, I managed <laughs> wow. to build one. So, the Kingdom of Italy, Giuseppe the First. Oh, that's really good that they are social democrats because if you are a social um, democrat, you can uh, peacefully reunite with the South. 
Because you're kind of both both uh, socialists. Oh, okay. See, oh. And then you're then you're just uh, democratic social democrats. Is your country uh, the government of your country then? So that's pretty pretty awesome. But yeah, if I wanted to play as a kingdom of Italy, I would want to have a, a fascist pope. It's a, I think that's the most fun to do. Um, we search this, so we can have a field hospital. Or you can, uh, in the Millennium Dome, you can also pick a... a Islamic a, pope, a yeah. Islamic pope, that's, that's the... That's the most strange thing I have. But yes. the, in its focus tree of the Vatican, there's something to annex the whole of Italy. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> pretty yeah. funny. I've seen it as well. Yeah. So the great debate is almost finished. Oh my God, that debate took long. <laughs> yeah, it's a really. They're discussing the the height of the king, how big the king's desk must be. Uh, oh boy. And then the the very last question is, where does the king come from? Does he come from uh, Austria, Poland? Lithuania or Germany or yeah that's the only options I will have because these things I can't do anymore yeah I could yeah I could join Russia here why but, don't uh, they pick a guy oh, from Poland <laughs> uh, but that's not uh, I'm, I want to uh, unite with Lithuania okay. so it's gonna be the same king I guess Mindogas the third of Urach if you so what's your goal restore Poland or Poland Lithuania and restore Poland to its former glory well then you'll have to fight I think you'll have to fight white Rutenia I'm not sure, sure. yeah so Germany Galicia Ukraine white Rutenia but Germany I will fight Germany when they have the war with the syndicalists because then they are very very weak we've seen it uh, I'm gonna pause the game because um, I have now the option to invite uh, the Lithuanians or the Lithuanians and the Commonwealth. The Lithuanians have declared a re renewed interest in the re recreating the Commonwealth. Yeah, I want to agree the proposal. I want to. I want to. Uh, yeah, my great debate is almost done. The great debate. Poland. Long live the Poland. Polish Lithuanian Commonwealth. We will stand united, but no. now uh, I. S uh, phew. Yeah. Do I still have uh, cultural effect of Black Monday? So I need to. Yeah, I need to go uh, down there, Lithuanian. So, what do I need more? Oh, I have all. Wait. Yeah, I need. I basically need to choose all my things again, all my, all my um, production, all my, oh, uh, no. all that stuff. And your focus tree changed. Yeah, that as well. Um, I need to choose research again. So I think I was doing this, and I was also researching this, and I was also researching this. I think. Then. You have something called the Galician Purchase. Oh, I will do that, I guess. Now I'm in Middle Europa, in the faction. Ah. Um, I think my field marshal was this guy, yes. My factories need to start over with... Uh, I was building some civilian factories here. You nah. sided with the Germans. Temporarily. Temporarily. So... Now, where is the purchase of Lithuania? Where, or the, um, where is it? Uh, let me tell you, it's under the a new capital. It's under that focus tree. Yeah, new capital. Then you have uh, under that the middle Europa question. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And you follow that down to the right bottom, the right bottom. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Purchase. Yeah. Then I think you'll gain them back. But I need to. Um, I uh, need to steal the most, so I will go go down the Polish infrastructure focus tree, and now we can play again, because. Oh. 
Well, let the people vote for. No, no, no. Don't want democracy. Yeah. Sweden's finest. Cool. That's uh, something. Oh yeah, and uh, my unity will go up, which is really necessary because it's only thirty percent right now. Ooh! Oh my god! Oh, I'm gonna. Oh, I need to recruit a historian in my in my government. I I I have a historian in my government. <laughs> Wait, he's Lithuanian, I guess. Oh, look at my king. He looks like oh, it's uh, one of the actors in low popularity. That's not good. Oh my god. So many totalists. Okay. My country has this really weird sh shape. <laughs> can I can I No, I can't. Ah. Uh, how are you doing? Um Oh yeah, we need to know. renew this. Not a lot is happening. Oh, and my division training stopped. So let me see. That's 18 combat with. With uh, yeah, gonna train these guys. Once, five guys, and my capital. So now I don't really need to worry about uh, Germany again. But I. Yeah. Do have a border with Russia now? <laughs> a really small one. Oh, no. My shape is so weird. <laughs> My country shape. <laughs> it's really weird. Radical socialists are gaining. Yeah, you need to worry about them. Mm -hmm. Yes, uh, increase in stability. That's good. I have minus 233 uh, political power. So, hmm, not the best. Not the best. Like Maybe I shouldn't, uh, yeah. Bilingual, bilingual um, government. Oh, shit. Minus 40 political power. <laughs> now I'm at minus oh 271. Uh, Norway only has 1.3 or, uh, or 1.5 manpower. Yeah. 5k, 1.5k. That's really nothing. But yeah, on what law are they? If you increase the law. They are, they are on limited conscription. I am on volunteer only and I'm now at 417k. So annexing Lithuania was a, a good thing for my uh, political power. <laughs> uh, manpower. Uh, manpower. Not for my political power because I'm at minus 268. <laughs> oh, damn. Yeah, because we basically united two very unstable countries. We merged them together and we have a very low stability. So, very bad. Very bad. They have all these, all these things in here. Uh, I need to focus on political power. Yay, we're now medium popularity. Yay, popularity change. Uh, la 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 la. Concentrate. Dispersed. Okay. Um. So all these things, yeah, I'm going to go for a new capital. That's the most logical one, I guess. So my Polish infrastructure will increase now. I'm going to go for a new capital, yeah. Yeah, I can form a new government, hooray. I don't know where the new capital will be. Yeah, but why a new capital? Because Warsaw. it's... Uh, I can choose between Warsaw and Vilnius, but I want... Um, a neutral one because we are a new l country new people Poland and Lithuania need to merge truly and we can only merge if we have a new neutral capital oh, Burma. Okay, it's only um, I would want to have a colony of my own one day 
I could do that if Middle Europe, Middle Africa declares war. Oh, they already have declared war on Portugal. If Germany joins and then I can join in. And if there's a peace deal, I can take the colonies. Should I uh, support enterprise? Yeah, su uh, support the enterprises. Otherwise, you'll become a uh, syndic or a most more socialist and syndicalist. So uh, support the enterprise and then the greater good. You need to go down there. Basically, now I'm. Less to do, so or you can change your popularity. Oh, My yeah. army size doubled because of that annexation but my stability is really low now I, I changed my uh, stability to good and now I got 65% yeah. unity it went up uh, a lot uh, I need to oh, choose yeah. this, the, the things that um, Curtis. Okay, so that basically happens every time. Building the new capital. That's the one that could make cultural tensions. Okay, so oh my god, I just look at my national unity. <laughs> Ten percent national unity. <laughs> Ooh, you're in a heavy crisis. Minus minus three hundred and fifty political power. What? Uh, what it's have you done? it's not that stable as Canada. <laughs> no, not at all. So I need to choose the stuff that gives me political power and um oh shit. That would have given me more political Changing power. Changing your stability but level. <laughs> but you can only change uh oh yeah. No, let my I mean your I need to solve the cultural tensions that will give me more national Mr. unity. Uh yeah. Right. First time. Yeah, I need to do that. It's, it all takes so long, though. You can increase the game speed if you want. Ne no, no. It, I mean, everything takes seventy days to complete. It's not gonna matter if I. <laughs> it's it's just gonna take a very long time until I can do uh, stuff as Poland conquer stuff. I mean. I got an extra factory. Hooray. I think as soon as one of my big cities fall, I I just capitulate. That's yep. that's it right now. Ten national unity. That's like shit. <laughs> Take Warsaw and game over. No, even closer. Lublin is very oh, okay. Political power gained. Just gonna need to pause the game here. Okay. Division. Uh, where is all these things are too close to borders. Bl yeah, yeah, uh, this, this one, this one. That's my new capital. A new capital. Solve the cultural tensions. Play. Okay, so I've solved the cultural tension, or I'm solving the cultural tensions. My capital is now. Not gonna even try to pronounce it. Well, <laughs> Bialgistok. I think it's it's something like that. The greater good. Oh, we have that war again. Yep. I wonder who's gonna win this time. Uh, what is the Netherlands do? What are they doing? Military expansion. Okay. I hope they don't do the revolution here, because then they join. Oh, uh -oh, uh, it, started. Uh -oh. it started. They didn't avoid it. Sadly, though. Second American Civil War. Okay. Yep, that's the situation. Okay, just gonna right. decrease. Oh, and New England speed. became independent as well. Uh, sorry that I need to decrease speed, but five okay. is just too m too fast. That's not good. If you need to choose technologies, you lose time. If you need to choose, um, okay. Democracy prevails in the Philippines. Hey, I didn't have that event. Yeah, we did. Did we? I think we did. Let's go to very good stability. You just go up and I, <laughs> I'm i just going down the <laughs> shithole. <laughs> yeah. And how's Hawaii? Oh, Hawaii is also... Okay, cool. but um, I think yeah. we'll uh, have a cut here. Have a first episode here. Um, yeah. And then we'll see you in the next episode. Bye!